address or Office 365 mailbox data backup, into Office 365 account, let's start the video. Go to Google and enter. SysTools Office 365 Backup and Restore. Click on the link shown on your device screen. Click on the download button. Then install and run the software. This is an interface of the software. On top of the software, there is a backup and restore buttons, select as per the need. I am moving with the backup process. Now in the source platform, there are a few options such as, G Suite, Office 365, and, O365 Archive. And, in the destination platform, there is only an Outlook. Select as per the need, I am selecting, to Office 365 as the source, and, Outlook as the destination. Now from the workload section, users can select the categories for the backup, such as email, document, contact, and calendar. And to download the backup data of a specific time period, then use the date range filter option. Now click on next button. Now in the source panel, enter here, credential, admin email, and application ID. Now from the right side of the software, validate button appears. Click on the validate button to grant the permission. Once the permission is granted, the user can move to the destination panel. Now here we have done with the source panel. Destination platform. Click on browse button and set the destination location to save the resultant file. Choose the desired PST file size from drop down. This option will split the resultant file in the set file size. The same as clicking on the validate button. Now permissions are granted. Click on the next button. Now in the user panel. Here tool provides a few options to add the user such as fetch user, import user, and download template. I am moving with fetch user. Here the alert comes up. This option will fetch the user from the configured source account. Click on the continue button. Now all the source users are listed here. Here you can select and deselect the user to move forward. Then click on the validate button to authorize the selected source account. All users are validated. Click on the OK button. Click on the start backup button to start the backup process. The software will check your license and provide details, then click on the start button, for the backup. User can check and preview the status under the complete tab. Now click on the download report. Here two options are displayed which are. Backup summary report. This option will download a single report displaying all the user accounts along with complete backup details of selected items. And rest is detailed report. This option will download individual reports, of all selected G Suite user accounts, with their backup details. Now click on the download button, and, save the report. Click on the rerun the backup button, three options listed down. Retry failed items, to back up the data which didn't download. Rerun full backup, to perform the entire backup process again. And Delta backup to back up the newly arrived data without duplication. Here we have done with backup process. And that's it, hope you enjoy the video. Log on to the given product page. For more details on purchasing the product. For any query, Mail us at support at the rate systoolsgroup.com. Thank you for watching.